What is up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we're going to be playing some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. I'm actually leveled up quite a bit. I'm on stage 10 now. We're actually just at the Mai fight, and I couldn't beat her the first few times that I tried to. So, we are going to be opening up a few packs. And by a few, I mean quite a few. So, let's get right into it. So, I think we're actually going to be opening up a whole bunch of Ultimate Rising packs and Neo Impact packs. Now, Obviously, Ultimate Rising has a lot of the staple cards that you want if you're going to make a decent deck, but Neo Impact has one card in particular, one Ultra Rare, that's just so far above everything else, which is called Mirror Wall. Now, you guys can see here, each of your opponent's monsters that conducted an attack while this card was face up on the field has its attack halved. As long as this card remains on the field during each of your standby phases, pay, or pay 2,000 life points or destroy this card. Now, that is not something that's going to be irrelevant after a long period of time when there are new power creeped cards that are better than the cards that are out right now. This is a card that's going to be useful no matter what time it is, no matter when it is. And I do think that it's going to be a staple in pretty much every single deck to run at least one of them for a very, very long time, if not forever until it's forbidden or whatever they call the banned list. So yeah, we're going to be opening up like 20 packs of Neo Impact and I think 20 packs of Dark Rising. So let's get right into it. Okay, so 10 packs of Neo Impact first right off the bat. Let's see how it goes. All right, so we've got, okay, uh, it's nothing special, I don't think. All right, um, anti-aircraft flower, that's whatever. Fusion weapon, we got a rare, that's not bad. And Naturia Strawberry. I don't know if Naturia are even at all good. I don't think they are, but you know what? We'll take it. Uh, we've got another Kribo and nothing special out of this pack either, I don't think. We have Scanner. I'll have to read that later. Uh, Ray of Hope. I mean, I guess that's okay. It, it's weird because there are some cards that could definitely be in some sort of like fatigue deck where you sort of base the deck off of making sure that your opponent runs out of cards before you do. But right now, the strategy just isn't there. The The amount of cards that you'd actually need to make the strategy work just isn't there. Uh, we got nothing special out of this one. I gotta say, I really like the way that you open packs in this game in particular. It's really, really fluid, and it feels like you're just, like, cutting the pack open, you know? Like, it feels like you're actually opening the pack. It's nice. Uh, we got Guardian Seal. That's... I don't even know. I, I, don't, I don't even know, guys. Nothing special, I don't think. Synthesis Spell... Gravedigger Ghoul, Common Charity. Now, if I miss a card that's good, I apologize. I don't know what's great in the meta right now. I really am new to this game. So we're just opening up a bunch of packs and hoping we get something good out of it. We got Fairy King Truesdale. I remember that McDonald's promo. I, I remember getting that promo. That was fun. We got Dragon Seeker as well. That's kind of cool. Oh, we got three, but we don't have the one afterwards. Oh! What could this be? Oh, what's this? What's this? What's this? Uh, Servant of Catabolism. A major upset. Regretful Rebirth. So we got a super rare card, guys. That is fantastic. Wow. Uh, I'm not sure if this is a good card or not. When a monster you control is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, target that monster, special summon it face up in defense position, but it is destroyed during your end phase. Huh. So you get it for an extra turn, basically. That's kind of cool. I like the effect. I think that it could definitely be useful. Okay. Painful Escape, Ritual of Grace, Guardian Grarl. That just seems odd to me. Guardians, I just, I don't know if Guardians are actually good or not, so I guess we'll see. Uh, Wadapon, I remember that's a movie promo. That's cool. Treaty on Uniform Nomenclature, okay. Machine King Prototype, I remember that card as well. Uh, Tribal Card, so that's kind of neat. Oh, what do we got in here? Not used to seeing that. That's interesting. We, we got that for the super rare, but I don't think... I, I didn't know that it did it for anything else. Uh, Woodland Sprite and... Element Valkyrie. Okay, so that's not too special, I don't think. But whatever. We got High Tide on Fire Island. Anti-Aircraft Flower. We're getting a lot of anti-aircraft flowers. That is ridiculous. We got Element Dragon as well. That's kind of cool. I do like that card. Um, oh, wow, that's 10 packs already. So we got one super rare, regretful rebirth, and that's all. So that's that's okay. That's okay. We can go for 500 more gems for another 10 packs. We'll, we'll make it 40 packs this episode. We'll do 40 packs. 
That sound good to you guys? Uh, we got Furin Kazan. Cry Havoc. We got two rares that pack. Another Naturia Strawberry. That's cool. We have the beginning of the end. Ritual of Grace. Beckoning Light. All right. Another Wadapon. That's cool. Ritual of Grace. Fusion Weapon. Okay. Come on. Something good. Give me some good, please. Uh, Treaty on Uniform Nomenclature. Woodland Sprite. Two-man Cell Battle. I remember that card, too. That was that was cool. Ooh, what do we got? Woo. Uh, oh, we got gold. We got gold, guys. What does that mean? Oh, wow. And we got the little eye thing. Again, I don't know what all of this actually means. I know that it means something, though. Uh, we got Destruction Cyclone. Phantom Cricket. And Super Rare Dweller. Dweller. Dweller in the depths. Not bad. Uh, this card gains 300 attack for each continuous spell card in your spell and trap zone. That's... I... Ooh. I feel like that could be good. I feel like that could be good in the right deck. I definitely think that it's good for beatdown decks. We'll have to check that out in a little bit more depth in the future, see if we can make a beatdown deck with it. But that seems like it'd be pretty solid. Uh, we got a blue one. Blue... Bam! Whoa! Whoa, bam! What, is this? what does bam mean? We got Phantom Cricket. We got sound effects and everything going on here. What is going on? Anti-aircraft flower. And ultra rare Kaiser Sea Kaiser Kaiser Seahorse. Wow. This card can be treated as two tributes for tribute summon of a light monster. So it is a 1700 attack normal drop. And it can be treated as two tributes for a light monster. That is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. Fantastic ultra rare. Fantastic card. So, so happy we got something that powerful that we can just throw into a deck and have it be worth 1700 attack is just a normal throw it down play as a beat down monster. That is fantastic. I am so, so happy with that. That is like, honestly, that is a really solid card to pull here. And I don't, I don't think we're going to get anything better than that. I don't know how you can top that, to be completely honest. We got Destruction Cyclone. Millis, Milus Radiant. I remember that. And Release Restraint Wave. Okay. Ooh. What do we got here? Chaos End. Servant of Catabolism. Two-man Cell Battle. Okay. That's fine. And... This is the last one? I think it might be. Meteor Dragon. That's cool. That was another McDonald's promo. Ray of Hope. Element Dragon. Oh, no. We have more. Okay. I'm losing it, guys. I'm sorry. Ultra Rare just kind of just threw it all... Threw everything around. My head, my head is all scrambled now. Meteor Dragon, Shadow Slayer. Okay. All monsters your opponent's controls are in defense position. This card can attack your opponent directly. That's actually really solid. I like that. Kind of counters defensive deck. So that that is. Oh man, that was solid. We got. We got some really good stuff there. Particularly though, Kaiser Seahorse. Just oh my god, that is sick. So that that is that is great. I'm I'm really happy with that. Um, do we continue? Do we continue with the Neo Impact ones? I kind of want to go back to going through the uh, Neo Impact ones. I think we're gonna do that. I think we're gonna keep going, keep trying to grab that mirror wall. So I guess we can't get another Kaiser Seahorse. That's interesting. We're gonna go for 40 packs, guys. We're gonna get 40 packs this episode. How does that sound? And then we'll challenge my and then that's going to be the end of the episode uh man throw throw buster rancher kuchulain the awakened i remember that card that's cool oh we got blue what do we have here emissary of the oasis radiant spirit element dragon that is not what we were looking for i thought we were going to get super rare there but that's fine that's fine we're, we're all good we are fine the kick man radiant spirit and ritual weapon Ooh. We got rainbows going on here. We got the bam. We got the bam. We got the rainbows. We got the multiple Karibos there. Altar for tribute. Sprite's blessing. Ultra rare. Stamping destruction. Wow, guys. If you control a dragon type monster, target one spell trap card on the field. Destroy the target. And if you do, inflict 500 damage to its controller. That is hardcore. That is a powerful spell right there. Wow. Like ultimate removal. Very cool. So... Definitely in the future that's going to be useful, especially as more dragons come out. Obviously, Stamping Destruction is going to be more useful, considering it is a utility card. So, that's very, very cool. Very happy about that. We got our second Ultra Rare. 
We got Wadapon, Buster Rancher, and Machine King. And Coach Goblin, that's a new one. Raijin, another new one. And Grey Wing, another new one. We are getting some new cards. It's weird because sometimes we see cards that we've seen before pretty often. We got Okay, we got the eye thing. Uh, sometimes we see cards we've seen often, and then sometimes we get like a pack full of completely new cards. Magical Merchant. Jerry Beans, man. Super rare. That is a beatdown card right there if I've ever seen one. 1,750 attack. That thing is a little warrior right there. That thing is crazy. Wow. Very nice. Okay, we got another super rare. And it's a beatdown card. So we've got two beatdown cards that are like really, really solid beatdown cards this pack opening. So I'm very happy with it. Emissary of the Oasis, Chopman, the Desperate Outlaw, Beckoning Light. Oh, whoops, sorry about that, guys. Uh, Servant of Catabolism, Puppet Magic of Dark Ruler, Beckoning Light, we're getting another one. Ooh. Shine for me, baby! We got the rainbows going on now. Synthesis Spell, Magical Merchant, and Super Rare, Gravity Axe, Grarl. Okay. Very cool. So that's an equip spell card, I believe. The equip monster gains 500 attack monsters. Your opponent controls cannot change their battle positions. Wow. Wow, that is that is like a shutdown card if I've ever seen one. Very, very nice. Okay, so we're, that that I'm pretty happy with. That's pretty solid utility right there. So that time, we got two super rares and an ultra rare, guys. And we're not even done. We're going to be doing 10 more packs, okay? 10 more Neo Impact, and we'll see how it goes. I'm hoping... What? Oh, and we got the eyes too. Oh boy, oh boy. Arcane Archer of the Forest, Grave Digger, Ghoul, and Meteor Bee Dragon. Third ultra rare for this opening. Good god, man. Oh my god. That is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. We've got three ultra rares this opening. 3,500 attack, 2,000 defense. That thing is just. Oh my god, powerful. This powerhouse. Absolute powerhouse. Okay, so there, there's no way we're going to get anything. Shut up. You don't play with my emotions like this. Can't do this to me, man. Okay, we got Ritual. There's a Ritual Ultra Rare, right? Paladin of White Dragon. Ritual card. Super rare. <laughs> Just... Wow. Shine for me, baby. High Tide on Fire Island, Zeradio's Blessing, Guardian Seal, yada yada. Okay. Let's... Uh, Guardian Seal. Alright, come on. We got, we got the sparkles, guys. We got the sparkles. Okay, Soul Demolition, Sprite's Blessing, and another Paladin of White Dragon. That's actually really interesting. Uh, you can ritual summon this card with White Dragon Ritual at the start of the damage step. Card... Attacks a face down defense position monster. Destroy that face down monster. You can tribute this card. Special summon one blue eyes white dragon from your hand or deck. The blue eyes white dragons cannot attack for the rest of this turn. That is insane. This could actually be a really solid card. Um, I don't know. Maybe with the reduced hand sizes and everything, this doesn't get played. Maybe it does. I'm not sure to be completely honest, but it's definitely worth revisiting in the future. That is 100% for sure. No shine here. We have another Wadapon, anti aircraft Flower, Dragon Seeker. No shine here either. Altar for Tribute, Painful Escape, Common Charity. No shine either. Synthesis Spell, Ray of Hope, DD Crazy Beast. That's a cool card. Uh, ooh, we got a shine. We got a blue shine here. All right, what do we got? Altar for Tribute, Raijin, Machine King. Again, really cool card. Not super rare, though. Okay, come on. Give me that rainbow. We got the rainbow. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Bam. We got the bam and the rainbow. Okay. Give me something good. Absorbing Kid from the Sky. Phantom Cricket. And Leotar. Super rare. If this card battles a non-normal monster, this card gains 500 attack during damage step only. Wow. So it becomes a 2,000 attack monster. During damage step. That is, again, another solid beatdown card. We're going to have a really, really solid setup as far as beatdown decks are concerned towards the future. Because we have at least three cards that I can think of immediately from this opening 
that are just great beatdown cards. And a few of them actually, no, four. We've got four at least. Wow, very nice, very nice. Okay, so we got some really solid stuff from that. Again, that Meteor B Dragon, Meteor Black Dragon. Very cool, very, very cool. Very happy about that one. And guys, that is going to conclude this pack opening, but don't fret, we have a little bit more to do today. Obviously, we can go ahead and do these achievements here. I haven't opened many packs yet, so I got some achievements from that. But yeah, let's go ahead and challenge my... Actually, here. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll change around our deck real quick, and then we'll do that. I gotta put the beatdown cards in. I gotta make sure that we are ready for my, because she just beat me up before. It was not good. All right, guys, I messed around with my deck. I made it so it's a little bit more beatdown oriented, and now we're gonna go ahead and battle my... I did have a bit of an issue with her before. I don't think we're going to now. My deck has been upgraded so, so, so much. It's ridiculous at this point. So, she just said she was going to pluck, pluck me like a chicken. That is, that's not good because, um, you know, name and all that. But anyways, 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 we're going to go ahead and we're going to try to beat my Valentine. So... This was, this was a pretty hardcore match when I first tried it. Again, I don't know if it's going to be like that now. Uh, we have Naturia Strawberry. We have Shadow Slayer, which is solid. We have DD Crazy Beast. Oh my god. That's crazy. We're going to play that right off the bat. Probably shouldn't have done that, actually. Probably should have stuck with our Strawberry, but... You know what? That's totally fine. We'll go over to her turn. We'll see what she does. Okay, now we can uh, now we can play. Um, okay, here we'll we'll draw a card, whatever. Uh, we'll play our nice little strawberry there. We'll play strawberry, and we'll switch over to our battle phase. We're gonna just go for the 1600 damage on it um, because it could have 1400 defense. We don't want to deal with that. Um, but it, it does have 1400 defense. I did make the right choice there. We're gonna go for a direct 1400 damage there now. Again, I just, I'm not seeing this being an issue, guys. It's, it's really not going to go well for her. This is going to start sort of snowballing pretty fast. Hopefully the cam was okay this episode. I apologize if it's not. Oh my god, with these notifications. Apologize for the notifications. Very, very sorry about that. Alligator sword, very cool. Um, so now, now we're going to... Shadow Slayer. No, we're not. What am I talking about? We will... We'll just Alligator Sword. How about that? We'll just do that. And then we're going to attack 1600 on whatever that is. Probably another Harpy Sister, I would assume. And then we'll probably win. Harpy Girl. Yeah, okay. So now we win. We just straight up won, guys. That is... It was that easy. I can't believe I had issues with this before. I guess it was only because my max attack for a 4-star card was only 1300 or 1350 at that point. And I only had one 1350 in my deck and a few 1300s. So if I had a 1400 attack, then I was just done. Okay, yada yada, Joey. We get it. You're awesome. Alright. We get it. It makes sense. It doesn't make sense. Uh, we got the free gems. Not bad. And plenty of score to get those cards build up our collection a little bit very nice all right why are we disconnected here i've noticed that quite a bit lately we've had a few issues with disconnects but it's fine i'm impressed you've defeated me but that doesn't mean i'm abandoning my dream a duelist courage is put a test blah 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 blah. okay let's uh let's let's get the show on the road please that's that's nice okay you're gonna level up cool all right we'll get our free gems there we'll get some more free gems 100 gems very nice there we're gonna Go up to stage 11. Very cool, very cool. Up to six standard duelists will appear from now on. That's awesome. Uh, unlocked my Valentine character as well. Required unlock missions to obtain this character. Oh, there are missions to obtain my as a character. Wow. Four tribute summons, five monsters in one duel. Dual world duel with 3,000 life points remaining seven dual world duels and complete all stage missions okay that's actually really good we get twenty thousand from that one as well we completed two more special missions very nice yeah we're gonna be getting a ton of stuff in the future though guys this is gonna be a lot of fun again if you guys enjoy these episodes please drop me a like and a comment 
expressing it. I really, really do appreciate the input. If you have any criticism or anything, likewise, I would really, really appreciate the comment as well. But yeah, guys, that's going to be about it for this one. Hopefully you enjoyed the card opening and the battle. That was a little anticlimactic against my. Hope to see you back here for the next video, probably tomorrow. I'm going to see how long we can keep up the daily upload schedule. If it drops off for a day, my apologies. I will explain on Twitter or in the next video. But yeah, guys, I really, really appreciate the support. We got a decent bit of support on the last episode, which was the first episode for this game. So thank you guys so much. Hope to see you back here for the next video very, very shortly. And until the next one, peace.